question we have at two. So we have a cube. I always find the diagram a huge help in these questions. So we have a cube with the invisible lines. And what's happening with the cube? The length of the edge is the cube. The length of the edge of the cube is decreasing at a rate of 4 centimeters per minute. So that would be dl dt is equal to 4 centimeters per minute. So if the edge of the cube is decreasing, what else is decreasing? The volume and the surface area are also decreasing. Are they all decreasing at the same rate? No, different rates. What is the value of n if v, the volume of the cube is given by v where x is in the room? I don't know what that means. What is the value of n if v Oh, yeah. The volume of this cube is equal to x to be cubed because it's x by x by x. And if I'm calling that x, that's now the x to t. So the volume is given by what formula? x to be cubed. That's the first part. But if the surface area of the cube, do you know the surface area of this cube? It's 6x to be squared. Is that all right? Any questions there? Each side is x by x, x squared, and the six up. Right? Explain why the x dash t or the x dt is negative. Now, why is the x dt just become negative now? Because it's decreasing. Find the rate at which the volume of the cube is decreasing. So, what am I asked to find? dv dt. Is that okay? dv dt is dv d something by d something d t. Any questions? So I've changed what I've been asked to find into a what? I change it into a chain rule. All right. And why do I change it? They're all all these are are just chain rules. What have you got to do? You've got to find the chain rules. All right. Better now. So dv d x by dx d t. dv dx. If v is equal to x cubed, what does that mean that dv dx is equal to? 3x to b squared. So that's 3x squared times what? Minus 4, which is minus 12x to b squared. dv dt centimeters cubed per minute. Now, in order to work out that, they have to tell me what x is. Do they tell me? At x equal to 10, that's minus 12 times 10 to be squared, which is 100 minus 1,200 centimeters cubed per minute. That's the rate at which the volume is going down. The rate at which the surface area is also decreasing. So that's v. That's v, a, d, t. How will I work out the ADT? It's a chain rule. It's the AD something by the something D T. What will I put into this one? The X is well. The ADX differentiate that? Twelve X times minus four, which is minus forty eight X centimeters squared per second. So add X equal to ten. That's equal to minus forty eight times ten centimeters squared per second, which is minus 480 centimeters squared per second. Are we all right there? Pardon me? I thought these were given in centimeters. Per minute it is per minute. It's unusual to have minutes, but it is per minute because this one here at the start was per Yeah. Any other questions? Is that all right? So all we need is, every one of these is what? The chain rule. Of these, what happens? You're given one, and you differentiate to calculate the other. Now you'll need that when you get to the harder.